this elections bill is a hugely missed opportunity to modernise our electoral law, to bring it into the 21st century, and actually try and encourage people to participate in our democracy. Indeed, our democracy is stronger when more people uh, take part in it. Yet in this bill, we see that uh, the leaders would like to choose the voters. I believe the voters should choose the leaders of their country. We should be making sure that our elections take place on public holidays. We should be exploring the idea of weekend voting. We should be looking at ways of modernising our democracy for the 21st century. And this elections bill does nothing to modernise and everything to put barriers up to participation. Labour will be voting against this legislation today, Mr Deputy Speaker. My colleagues on the Labour benches behind me have laid out in clear terms the dangerous consequences of this legislation. This legislation is unnecessary, expensive, costing £120 million over the next 10 years at least. It will have a chilling effect on democracy and it is an attack on free and fair campaigning. This legislation will see legitimate voters turned away from polling stations and local councils tied up in mountains of red tape and expense. It's a shameless attempt by the government to rewrite the rules and rig democracy in favour of the Conservative Party. If passed, this legislation will reverse decades of democratic progress in the UK.